It says it's gonna snow tomorrow, but I don't believe it because it's Tokyo and it never snows. I'm gonna show you my sketchbook. This is the first sketchbook of the year. This was like January to like March 3rd or something. Yep. January to March 3rd. So two months in total. And actually, just to show you comparison, I have another one just like it. And this one looks like, I don't know, like at least 50 less pages because it's not full of watercolor. Because I watercolor on pages that do not take well to watercolor. Because I don't care. It was January 1st when I started this. This is a pamphlet from the Bonnie Vere concert that I went to, which was pretty rad, although we got in very last. Because the Japanese have a very weird system for buying concert tickets, and we got it wrong. Okay. Here it is. The sketchbook. The sketchbook I dedicated my life to for an entire two months that I slaved over and cried over, and it is full of crap. But let's go through it, shall we? Um, alright. So here are my... January 2016 art goals. But basically the goal with this sketchbook was to be lo loose. This is all the stuff that I used, oops, in the sketchbook. It's the first page. Um, just kind of starting off not really knowing what I was doing. This is April from, uh, what's it called? Pieces of April, which is a very good Thanksgiving movie. I highly recommend it. This is weird tape that I bought. Uh, that's uh, Gudetama, the lazy egg. Um, you'll see probably some miraculous ladybug in this book, but that's only because my life is dedicated to it. No big deal. It's kind of hard to flip these pages. All right. This was inspired by uh, Melanie Martinez, Pity Party. It's a great song. Just kind of did a character sort of based on her style. Oh, that's upside down. I don't even remember that page. Uh, that was not a very good page. That's from an idea for sort of a story that I have in mind. Um... Yeah, I don't like that. Let's just look at this. This is nice. I was trying to draw more guys. They're the bane of my existence. I did that from a reference. His body's kind of uh, not really proportioned well, but you know. Um, you can't have it all, you know. This is while watching... I was watching Secret Life of Bees. Fantastic movie. Um, so this is sort of a character based off of Lily. Um, Purple Man. That's Lily again, for the quote from the movie. It really is a great movie, although you will cry like seven times. Um, that was fun. I use, I use a lot of pen in this book. I like this menacing guy in the corner. He's my fave. I think for this, I, I did it in pencil, then I watercolored it, um, then I went over it with pen. Oh yeah, this is kind of a dumb page, but that's uh, Yellow Pearl. She's my favorite character ever. I love her so much. Even though she's only there for like 20 seconds, I still love her. Um, hand practices. Doodles. Oh, I love, I love, love this Eggman so much. His cup says Big Mom. I don't know why. Um, this was drawn with my left hand because my right hand was hurting for some reason. So, you know, you gotta draw though. You gotta. So, I did. So you can see I used a lot of different stuff on like every page, kind of. I used like watercolor, pen, Jim and Pam. Oh, during the sketchbook I started watching The Office, which was an amazing decision because Jim and Pam are adorable. 
Those are character. That's a character practice. I was I was um drawing the same shape over and over, but trying to make it a different person. So they have different features. It's a good exercise if you want to sort of get varied characters. Dean and Pam, they're so cute. You don't understand. You don't understand the amount of angst I went through. I don't know why I didn't just get clear tape though. I have this like really stupid like Moomin tape or something. I don't know. It's really ugly. Um, failed drawings. Oh. Who is that in the corner there? Who is that? This guy. He must be the brother of the, the Eggman. This is all in pencil. Jim and Pam again. This is better tape, I think. Stick them somewhere. I was practicing like accessories. I was just kind of like overloading her with like a bunch of design in her clothes. Um, this is when I got the brush pen, Pentel brush pen. And I was having a ball. I was having a field day with it. These are thumbnails for a Kylo Ren comic. It's a pretty angsty one though. There's like part of the Kylo Ren thing, although I didn't like the baby. He looks too old and weird, so. Um. Mm, um, this year, or maybe last year, but Daughter came out with a new album. Um, that was good. That's the lyrics from this, from the song, Doing the Right Thing. Or, it's the right thing, or something like that. This is my alien guy. If you've seen some of my other sketchbook videos, he shows up there and he also shows up here on a few pages, so it's like, where's Waldo? See, there he is. My son. There's Marinette. Um, that's a thumbnail for a... Uh, Rapunzel thing that I was gonna do. It's later on in here. More watercolor. So I drew that after I took the SAT this year. That's the Rapunzel sketch. Alright, I was trying to make it sort of finished, but I didn't really finish it. The idea was that the witch steals her eyes, so that she, if she leaves, she'll be lost forever. It's upside down. I don't really know what it is, though. Oh, I think it was, I was gonna try to do Princess Pam and Court Jester Jim. This is, um, this is Cal, Cal, Cassie? Yeah, Cassie from The Fifth Wave. So these are from my little sketchbook, but I uh, ripped them out and put them in here to keep them all together. That's Hades and Persephone. My friend drew this horse. I'm really not good at drawing animals all that well. Something I want to improve in though. These are characters from a story, or that other story that I was um, sort of creating. This too, kind of. Ava and Odin. That's also a thumbnail from the story.
This is when I had a cold. I was trying to sort of show how it felt. <laughs> this is a girl that eats hearts. Because they taste good and are useless. <laughs> it's a whole page of doodles. I was also sick. I was sick for a while, so... I painted and I vented a little bit. Uh, that's Percy. Jackson. This is with ink and my watercolor pen. More ugly tape, but this is Kylo Ren. This is Kylo and Leia. Oh yeah, and this is Cassie again. Kylo and Leia here too. I am not good at drawing babies. There's my man, my main man, my alien bro. Although he's not an alien, he's a human, but he thinks he's an alien. Mermaids. Supposed to be Kylo Ren. This is like a minimalistic Kylo Ren. <laughs> Man, I'm just realizing now how much he's in here. This is a demon who should have higher standards. This is me rent, uh, venting about Jason Rothenberg and how he should stop being mean to Bellamy and uh, and the and everyone in general. Character from another story in the works went to a I went to a Tokyo art museum. They had a, a Yoko Ono exhibit that was pretty cool. But I also liked their permanent selection. Um, so I just was feeling artsy, and I, this is the view from the museum. I like this lady. Characters from my story. It's a story that will someday come to fruition. But as for now, all I can do is sketch them. This is a gentle damsel. This is them again. I only know that her name is Beulah. It's an ugly name, but I like it. And I don't know his name. And I know I want her name to be Beulah. Um, but I don't know anything about that. I failed drawing um, Tracy Turnblad. So sad. <laughs> I like her because she looks very excited, but she does not know what she's doing. Oh, this is from Kimbra's music video for a cameo lover. I love that music video. It's not complicated really, it's just like dancing and amazing colors and men with nail polish and beautiful men as well and beautiful Kimbra and I just felt the inspiration man and I drew it and I drew also from her other music video for Settle Down. I just love her look and her clothes and I love her hair and everything about her. I was watching Emma felt in a romantic Victorian mood. My characters, they just change a lot, really, but what can you do? Just make decisions, that's what you can do, Manon. Yeah, well, it was a lady. I only saw the back of her, but I tried to illustrate what I thought she would look like from the front. That's Rapunzel. Mermaid. Or Siren. I don't know. They're the same. What is this frog saying? 
I am a frog and I like it this way. I feel the same. There was, I was waiting in line for the Shake Shack with my friends and I saw this very interesting man. There's Lars. I love Lars. This is from a game where you draw one half the face and someone draws the other. This was my half. There's a self-portrait. Those are always fun. Tree man. Mermaid. Warrior woman. Robots. Alright, we're nearing the end here, folks. The way she was sitting was pretty powerful. Felt the need to draw it. That's it. And then I also drew like kind of a mandala thing on the back. This is my next one. These sketchbooks have that weird like bean shape on them all the time. I just wanted to make sense of it and make it into something. So now it's a creepy pumpkin slash octopus. I kind of do hope it snows though.